Karokan Defense, Panov, Fianketo Defense, 6.QB3BG77.CXD500. Smooth one player took the advantage and never let go. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. White was a cut above black in the middle game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. In the Karokan defense, the pawns on d7 and d5 can be quickly pushed to take control of the center and engage the e4 pawn. The d4 square seizes the center and launches an assault on the e5 and c5 squares. The pawn on e4 is under attack from the center, where d5. X5 opens up the center, white can now develop the light squared bishop to d3, where it will attack black's king side. Cx d5 recaptures the pawn on d5 and leaves the c6 square open for the knight to develop. c4 obtains room on the queen side and center and gets ready to advance the knight to c3. Nf6 supports the d5 pawn and controls the e4 square. Nc3 puts more pressure on the d5 square and helps control the e4 square. The dark squared bishop is getting ready to be fianchetto to g7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. QB3 develops the queen, supports the c4 pawn and attacks the b7 pawn. Fianchetto move bg7 places the bishop on the long diagonal. Cx d5 captures the d5 pawn and controls the e6 and c6 squares. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is the final book action. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores an opportunity to develop a bishop by placing it on the long diagonal. It is an inaccuracy. Recaptures. It is ideal. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. It is ideal. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. This threatens to fork pieces. It is best. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. This is the only good move. This stops the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is a great move. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. That's good. This misses the chance to claim a free pawn. It falls flat. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. This threatens to kick a knight. It is best. This misses an opportunity to connect rooks. It is an inaccuracy. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. The knight is thus brought to safety. It is ideal. A solid choice. It is excellent. This disregards a more effective approach to link rooks. It is incorrect. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Backs off. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This reveals an attack on a rook. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This is an equal trade. It is best. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Thus, a bishop is lost. It is a mistake. This misses a chance to win a bishop. It falls flat. The bishop is now in a secure position. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This buys time by putting a rook in danger and getting it to flee. This poses a material threat. It is ideal. This move puts the rook on a safer square. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. 
This secures a pawn. That's good. This misses the chance to provide an equitable exchange of pieces. It is incorrect. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. Very precise. It is best. This poses a threat to strike a knight. That's good. This misses an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a knight. It is an inaccuracy. That is a logical response. It is quite good. This enables the adversary can grab an open file containing a rook. It is incorrect. That's fine. It is good. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. It is ideal. This misses an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. This permits the opponent to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This reveals an attack on a pawn. It is best. This strikes a rival knight. That's good. This attacks a knight, winning a tempo when it moves away. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. This is the only good move. It is best. Among the best actions. It is quite good. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. Now that the rook is on an open file, it is easier to control squares all over the board. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This protects a weak piece by trapping one of its assailants. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. By posing a threat to a knight and compelling it to flee, this wins a tempo. It is ideal. This shields the knight who was attacked. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. This is how you take the pawn. It is quite good. This steps away from the checking pawn. It is excellent. This captures a vulnerable pawn. It is best. This accomplishes this by posing a threat to a rook and compelling it to flee. It is quite good. This requires an open file, a typical technique for rook activation. It is quite good. A very strong play. It is excellent. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. That's good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. White is ahead at this point in the endgame. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. That's fine. It is good. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is good. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. The knight is thus brought to safety. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. A solid choice. It is excellent. This creates a threat to win a pawn. It is excellent. Smooth one player took the advantage and never let go. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. White was a cut above black in the middle game. 